Um, and the uh, Czech Republic and Norway, similar to Slovenia and Estonia, are also, um, they have also, they lack uh, the positive online content provision. Uh, what has already, uh, also been noted is that the, in the countries with the high use of internet, parents are actually mediating the use of internet more than television, whilst in the countries with lower use of internet, parents are still more mediating the TV use. Um, so uh, now let me conclude with the next step for our project. Uh, so in winter 2008, which, which is very soon, we are expecting the report on cross-cultural context of research. Um, then in the summer of 2009, uh, we are going to issue a final report and policy recommendations for awareness, awareness raising. And I would like to welcome everyone at our conference uh, in London, 11th of June. The call for papers is uh, published on the website, so everyone uh, who is working in this area is welcome to contribute. And I would also invite you to subscribe to our newsletter to receive updates and reports, which is going to be out one in March and one at the end of the project in June. Thank you. Thanks, sir. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dieter Carstensen. I normally work for Save the Children in Denmark, but I'm also the chairman of the European NGO Alliance for Child Safety Online, in short, INAXO. We are a very new NGO alliance. We uh, have started operating since 1st September 2008. So in terms of producing best practice in practical results, it is a bit premature. But itself, having an NGO alliance at such a great level uh, and coverage, we, um, we, we would like to classify this as being a best practice in itself. At least from a European point of view, it's a very good and uh, unique um, setup. In Axos' mission, as can be read here, is of course to promote and support actions at European and international level uh, in order to uphold and promote children's rights when we talk about new technologies, so the development of it, implementation and usage. Very often you will find yourself having legislators um, and politicians not really having always the correct view, according to our perspective, on how uh, mankind well, how you can improve uh, children's protection um, in developing policies, but also from industry, um, they would produce technologies, but they need to also have the input from children's rights advocates. So that, the, that is the mission. A new network needs to, of course, establish itself. We need to have a common understanding of what the problems are and how we want to implement our recommendations. So we have built it up in three phases that are, of course, overlapping each other in terms of time and implementation. But getting out, reaching out to a number of countries, we need to find countries that are of interest, for instance, based on uh, results coming from the EU Kids Online, which countries have challenges in terms of understanding the, uh, the issues, where are high-risk countries, how can we, as an NGO alliance, help improving the situation from a child-wise perspective. But for the common benefit of children and their online experiences. There will be a disparate understanding of the problems. There will be a, a different level of policy development in various countries. Some countries will be in the infancy of understanding online safety in general, or indeed dealing with cyber security as we speak. Our role is that to understand where are the best practices, the good practices we can sort of export throughout the network enabling uh, our members to build up the capacity and understanding of these best practices and then promote them at the national level. The same goes, of course, at the European level. We will be able to see what policies can be uh, improved, what experiences are we hearing from the other uh, networks, from the Safe Internet Program, for instance, InHope, dealing with transsexual abuse of images, what are the challenges here, can we as an NGO lobby group be able to improve that so we minimize the distribution or indeed the production of this. 